are going to study about liquefaction of air by Linde process. Linde process is the method of the liquid method. The air can be liquefied by the process two processes. Based on regenerative cooling and Joule Thompson effect. Air is the method of liquid method. The process is the method of the liquid method. Regenerative cooling. Regenerative cooling is again and again the method of cooling. कूलिंग प्रोसेस वंदे उपर दर दे एंड देन जूल तांपसन इफेक्ट है ओके रेंडे प्रोसेस वंदे उपर दे और यार यार नमे एड तो कुण्डल करें यार एड तो कल्ला पड़े यार वंदे हमें ना चेंज लाल लिक्विडा माते लाम बाय लिंडे प्रोसेस इन द प्रोसेस पेर इन दे लिंडे प्रोसेस सरिया फर्स्ट वंदे एटमॉस्फेरिक प C1, C1 का कंटेनर अल्ला, कंटेनर अल्ला वंदे, एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर लेटो पड़े, यार वंदे 25 एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर के कंप्रेस पन्ना पड़े, ओके, एंड देन इट इस पास्ट थ्रो यार कोल्ड वाटर बाद जैकेट, द कंप्रेस्ड यार वंदे ना दे, इस पास्ट थ्रो यार कोल्ड वाटर बाद जैकेट, कोल्ड वाटर वंदे सर्कुलेट इधर कपड़ा, the cool and कपड़ा आदि यहाँ न बोलिया पोग दे, cave oil solution, cave oil solution बोलिया इधर का उपोदे to to remove carbon dioxide and water vapour, अलेर का उपोदे carbon dioxide C O two यो, and then water vapour ये remove पन्दर द कागे ऐने चीज़ यहाँ न बोलिया अनबा पड़े, okay, हाँ it passes through the cave oil solution to remove C O two and water vapour, इधर वन्दे the figure लव वन्दे अधिवन्दे काटा पड़ला सरिया, and then the compressed air is again compressed to 200 atmospheres here by C2. C2 is a container in 200 atmospheric pressure. It is compressed by the cooled air. Cooled air is a high pressure. Then when you apply high pressure, the temperature is a degree. The temperature is reduced to minus 20 degrees centigrade. Okay? The air or the temperature is reduced to minus 20 degrees centigrade. And then the high pressure and the cooling air is passed through a jacket. It contains a freezing mixture. Freezing mixture is passed through a container. Okay? So, the temperature is minus 20 degrees centigrade. The temperature is minus 20. 20 degree centigrade के कोरंच बोल and then it passes through a nozzle end the comp the compressed high pressure air cooled air is passes through the nozzle end सरिया अंदर nozzle end वाली अंदर चाहिए दे pass आल दे आह ये pass हम बोले ना वो क्या the joule joule Thomson effect के takes place joule Thomson effect के अंदर यार बंदे ने दे high pressure cooling air बंदे ऊपर तो पड़ गया पर joule Thomson effect ना इन्हन पातों ना मैं हाई प्रेशर साइड लेने लो प्रेशर साइड के पोंग बोले दर इस यह फॉलिंग टेम्परेचर आओ अपो नासल वाली आ वर्क बोले ना वो अगेन बंदे दर इस यह फॉलिंग टेम्परेचर ये यार उनका टेम्परेचर बंदे ना वो नो मंजो डिग्री सागो एंड देन द दिस हाई हाई प्रेशर एंड कूल्ड एयर इस अगेन अगेन फास्ट थ्रो द uh, again compressed by compressed by C2. The process is continuously going on. This process is the regenerative cooling. The nozzle value of the the air, high pressure, high pressure, cooled air, again on the air. Again, return back to C2. C2 again compressed regenerative pro cooling process is continuously going on. Appa, Enago temperature of the air one day there again in ago no for you for and take over a poor this is continuously going up so yeah the other number regenerative cooling process to wrong a poor again when the temperature when the poor and for the day where they are cooling out there they are when the cooling out there the process one day continuous and around the day it's a young again and again also really over there again the C2 way compressed for the further and then and the freezing mixture area pause I again in our cell one day again in a little Thompson effect would put again in a day return back to C2 the process is continuously going on the cycle of process is continuously going on up and down now temperature of the room by reduce I wrong upon yeah the temperature is below the critical temperature 
below the critical temperature. Minus 140 degrees centigrade. Where is it? Minus 20 degrees is the same. We And then the temperature is reduced to minus 140 degrees centigrade. In the temperature is below the critical temperature. Minus 140 degrees centigrade. The, the, the air can be liquefied. It is collected in the Weaver's flask. So, yeah, Weaver flask collect. That is why we collect it. Weaver flask. Weaver's flask collect. So, yeah, this is the liquefaction of air process. Linde process. Linde process. We will liquid up liquid up. We will have a process. We will have a base. We will have regenerative cooling and Joule Thompson effect. Joule Thompson effect first and then regenerative cooling. So, yeah, atmospheric pressure is the same as the air. 25 atmospheric pressure pressure the same as compress C1. And then it is in the pass through a cold water bath jacket and then it passes through a KOH solution to remove CO2 and water vapor. And then it passes through the C2. Here, the air is again compressed by a C2 at 200 atmospheric pressure. Then I don't know, I don't know, cool on board. And then it, it is passed through a container, it containing a freezing mixture. For freezing mixture will be a home, and now you know, and the temperature, temperature of air can be reduced. Minus 20 degree centigrade, sorry, minus 20 degree centigrade, and I don't give one day, minus 20 degree centigrade, okay. 20 degree centigrade converter and then it passes through the through a nozzle and going on. This process is the energy of regenerative cooling. So, the nozzle is the energy of the air. High pressure, high pressure, cooled air again on the energy of the air. Again, the energy is the energy. Return back to C2. C2 again compress. Then, the regenerative cooling process is continuously going on. Then, the temperature of the air is the energy. Again, it is the energy. It is the energy. Then, this is continuously going on. Okay, this is the regenerative cooling process. Then, again, the temperature is the energy. The air is the cooling. The process is continuous and continuous. Okay, again, the nozzle is coming. Again, the C2 is going to compress. And then, the freezing mixture is passed. Again, the nozzle is coming. Again, the Joule Thompson effect is coming. Again, it is coming back to C2. The process is continuously going on. The cyclic process is continuously going on. Then, what is the temperature? The temperature is reduced. Then, the temperature is below the critical temperature. Below the critical temperature. Minus 140 degrees centigrade. How much is it? Minus 20 degrees is the first time. We have a process put and then the temperature is reduced to minus 140 degrees centigrade. In the temperature is the below the critical temperature. Minus 140 degrees centigrade is the The air can be liquefied. It is collected in the Weaver's flask. So, yeah, Weaver's flask. Collect पड़े रहो। अदा वंदे इंगे collect पड़ रहो। Weaver flask ला, Weaver flask ला collect पड़े रहो। सुनिया। इधर ना दे liquid action ना, यार process लिंडे process लिंडे process मुलामा, यार वंदे ना हमें liquid आ liquid आ मातला। इलावंदे इन्हें ना process वंदे इधर आगे ना हमें ये द वंदे ये द पन्द्रा आगे, ये द base पनीर के regenerative cooling and जूल टॉम्सन इफेक्ट फर्स्ट एंड देन रीजेनरेटिव कूलिंग सरिया एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर लेते हुए बुरी यार आवंदन है ना चेनो ना मैं 25 एटमॉस्फेरिक प्रेशर ला प्रेशर के आवंदन है चेनो कंप्रेस पन रों सी वन ला एंड देन इट इस इन्हें दे पास उतरो ए कोल्ड वाटर बाथ जैकेट एंड देन इट पास उतरो ए केवो at 200 atmospheric pressure. Then I don't know, I don't know, cool on board. And then it is passed through a container, it containing a freezing mixture. If the freezing mixture will be a home, I don't know, the temperature of air can be reduced. Minus 20 degree centigrade, sorry. Minus 20 degree centigrade, I don't know, minus 20 degree centigrade, okay. 20 degree centigrade for more. And then it passes through the, through a nozzle end. Nozzle end will be a very good. Now, 
जूल तामसन एफेक्ट हियर द जूल तामसन एफेक्ट टेक्स प्लेस जूल तामस जूल तामसन एफेक्ट ना इन्हें तो रियो हाई प्रेशर साइड लंदे लो प्रेशर साइड वाली या साइड के और एक गैस वंदे ना हम पास पन्न बोले आज वंदे ना दे वो एक कूलिंग प्रोसेस सदन कूलिंग प्रोसेस वंदे टेक्स प्लेस अच्छा <laughs> This is the Inde process, liquefaction of air by Inde process. This is very very important question for 11th physics and polytechnic physics. Okay, thank you.